How is it going? <laughs> so, so, I expected that it will be a little bit faster. Yeah, and hold not so but strong. It's pretty hard. Um, yeah, it's stone hard. brick. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. What we are actually doing right now, um, we are making new openings for the windows, for the new windows and for the doors. Let me show you the layout that we are aiming for. Let's make use of the whiteboard. So this is our milk house. A new marker, I guess. Okay. Mm. Uh, right now, what we have? We have door here and one door over here. We also have one wall here and one wall is here. Something like that. What uh, we plan to do, we want to leave this wall and keep this like a room. We will remove this door opening and just brick it up. There will be no door here, just one window. So one window. Um, this will be like a small bedroom and the door will be here. Here we are planning to remove this piece of wall completely so we will have it like that here we want to build a new wall this will be like a small bathroom like not real bathroom but a vc here and um, here a small wash basin actually just to wash your hands and your face and the door somewhere here probably here we are planning two windows to, because we want to uh, have here like a very big table for all of us to work and to have a nice view. Here gonna be a, a bed, one, and here probably another one, a big one. So ah, here also is a window. And here window. So we we are planning to have to keep the door here, one window here, one here. Uh, brick up this door, uh, make the door opening here and uh, here to build a new wall uh, with a door, and here to make two new window openings. So we stopped on this layout. We had uh, multiple layouts in our head, uh, like to keep both doors to keep uh, two bedrooms like separated yeah different but we think that this will work for our needs uh, the best so we we are aiming for it guys i need to buy new markers and maybe different colors so you could see what we are actually keeping and what we are removing in color it will be easier to understand but i hope you could follow my explanation let me know what you think about it.
used to fall apart Lose myself and give my heart away Come and go in shady places to sit and stare Now the light runs through my lashes oh, It's taken 40 years Blood is sweat and tears mm. It was very long weekend yeah, I finished this container and yeah, it was enough space to put all trash what we wanted, so I'm very happy with that. Yeah, it's a little bit late. So, and I want to go home. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And see you next time. I can't show you how to start to find your way. I like the old fashioned way. Give me that sweet.
another milestone is achieved. Uh, we have removed um, the roof from the milk house or a dairy how you mentioned in the comments. The roof contained asbestos, uh, that's why we had to be extra cautious. Uh, it took us around three hours, but pretty intense and uh, yeah, difficult, a difficult job to do, but luckily it's done. Mm, let me tell you a couple of words about um, how it's been done here in Belgium, the, abes the asbestos removal. The general rule is that you are not allowed to remove the loose asbestos, for example, the insulation around the pipes. For that uh, job you have to hire professionals. But the rest, like uh, uh, these asbestos sheets, uh, you can remove yourself. Uh, but be cautious and take all the safety measure measures. Here in my province, how it's been done, uh, we called our recycling park that we would like to remove asbestos roof. Uh, they came over to us, um, checked what we would like to remove, uh, calculated how many of these bags we would need. Uh, normally for this amount of roof the two bags would be enough, uh, but uh, our roof was with uh, moss and that's why it took more space. The lady also gave us two protection kits, uh, I would call it protection kits, um, that contained uh, one protection suit, uh, gloves and a special mask with a special filter. Um, the interesting details, she didn't ask about our sizes and sh just gave L, L size. And for Elia it was a bit too small and for me it was a bit too big, <laughs> but okay, it suits the peppers. The lady also instructed us how we need to remove the asbestos, that uh, we should not break the sheets, how we need to pack them, uh, where we need to store them after we will uh, remove all the sheets. We need to bring them to the street and uh, she also made an appointment uh, in two weeks when she will come and take them to the recycling park. So fast and easy and now I'm very happy that we have removed this naughty stuff from our farm. We still have a lot to go but step by step. Yeah. Ilya, how did you like the experience of removing the yeah, It was not bad, it's not a lot. Before we did much more and it was nice. But exhausting, nice. I don't yeah. know what is nice about the rooms. Is <laughs> Eas easier than than previous one. Yeah. Weather is perfect. So we want to enjoy this perfect weather. So see you next time. See don't you. forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> see you in a week. There and is a lot to come. Yeah. See you. Bye.